morning, good morning, and happy, happy Tuesday. It's a beautiful morning out, and another day of traffic. But the good thing is, I take that time to continue to fuel my mind. I listen to some personal development to get me going. Um, and it's going to be a good day. It's going to be a good day. It's Tuesday, so it's our in-person workout uh, tonight. So we meet um, at the park by uh, Mount Rubido. Um, and we're actually, we meet up protein donuts um, as your post-workout snack or a... Um, a tea booster I will confirm because I know um, I think it's the protein donut I think Tuesdays are the protein donuts and Sunday workouts are the the tea boosters so I'll post the flyer and the way to register is you can you can uh, scan that there's a QR code on the flyer and that's where you would register and the reason we need you to register so that we know how many um, donuts coach Alyssa needs to make for the workout so it's an incredible, incredible workout. It's focused on lower body um, and like hit cardio, but it really is a full body workout. And it's just incredible to be able to connect with the community. So definitely, if you've been interested, you want to come out and check it out. Um, it's going to be amazing. And as we embark on this amazing transformation Tuesday, I wanted to share... Um, especially because we're soon summer will be over and it'll be winter cold weather and that's the time when people get really comfortable and it just becomes a little bit harder to um, to focus on your goals so the importance of creating a discipline for yourself and your discipline does not look like anybody else's and I want to be very clear on that my discipline is years and years and years and years of being in action right so it does not have to look the same it's just about building consistencies within your daily actions that are gonna build your discipline so as we're going into the end of summer and the winter months um, number one how important it is to have a have a plan right and when I say have a plan I just mean have have a list of what your goals are like know what you want to accomplish knowing your goal is part of the process right so that you know you have something to look back on and say okay and is what I am doing in alignment to reaching these goals so have your set goals so that you know what you're working towards number two is um, have an accountability partner or in this case it would be for me my community support right staying accountable to my goals by having that extra support system um, sharing my goals with them they know what my goals are and so that also is a sense of accountability that's going to help me stay on track even on the days when I don't want to show up even on the days where maybe you're struggling that is what that accountability is for so the community a coach obviously I would want to be your coach um, but that is that was the one thing for me that really made the difference when I started my journey with Herbalife six years ago was having that accountability with the community and with a group of coaches because now it's not like I couldn't fall back on my own goal because I had already shared my goals and there's just a sense of responsibility that you feel when you know that other people know what you're trying to accomplish like you you said it out loud kind of right so it's just a different a different sense of like ur urgency so um, number three would be you have to have this unwavering self-belief and I know that it's really hard when you're first starting um, but that's where doing the inner work, right? That's what I call when I'm listening to positive audios and reading these these self-help books. All of that is building your confidence within yourself and your self-belief and your self-esteem. And that is just so important because at the end of the day, no one can make you do anything. Even me being your coach, I can motivate you as much as I as I can. But at the end of the day, it's all up to you. You 
you are in control of everything you are in control of how you show up for your goals how you show up for yourself the day-to-day things that you're doing to make those things happen and the only way that that you're gonna make it happen is you have to believe in yourself and a lot of times when we are first starting out that is the hardest part having that self-belief and that's part of why so many people um fail i know that at the beginning that's why i yo-yoed so much because i did not have that self-belief and for me it came from working on myself, working in here, doing the work in here, right? Giving myself that positivity every single day. And even it started with just interactions with other people in my community, um, absorbing that positive energy. And then it was like, okay, what are the things that make me feel good or, or get me into action? And it was like listening to, po- to positive audios, motivational speeches and things like that. Um, reading these, these incredible life-changing books um, and doing something every day to pour into my my mental cup right which I talk about my self-love cup but pouring into my mind every day because it's the same thing as when you are feeding your body good food what does your body do it runs at optimum level and same goes for your mind you got to feed it positive thoughts you got to feed it positivity in order to create that positivity right so I hope those are helpful to you um just getting into action every day is going to build that discipline and that consistency for you that's going to give you the results not only give you the results that you want but it's ultimately cultivating that inner inner discipline within you to make things happen and i'm not just talking about like your health and wellness goals it's overall right disciplines what a discipline in one area of your life creates disciplines in every area of your life and i know that once you start to build that that discipline and those consistencies in your everyday actions it's going to just absolutely change your life so happy tuesday guys i hope you have an incredible day and know that you get to create the energy of your day you get to decide what kind of day you're going to have